I'll show you how to get Win 2DS on your Nintendo DS. See? Right now, it says right here, it's a remote play on the DS. See? You use a shoe out there? See, on my computer. This is all you have to do. First, you go to this website. This could be in my description. And then, and then when you go to it, you'll go to download right there. And you scroll all the way to the bottom. And you find this, and you click on that. It'll just pop up a save window. I'm gonna cancel because I already have it saved. Here's what you do when you already have it. See, I'm gonna go to my documents. When you have it saved, shut up. Sorry about that. When you have it saved, it's gonna like wait. It's gonna appear that you extract it, and it comes with these files. It comes with the readme one right there, and the one DS, and then and and like a Game Boy whatever. Then you copy that to your Nintendo DS. Wait a second. Then get your DS. But I use actual replay for a bit. It still works. When I load my actual replay, I'm gonna go to my files. It's gonna be saved as my DS ROMs. Wait. DS ROMs. I click it. Wait a second. Then I find this file. I click it. It's gonna appear this. You you know this, but first you have to do this. See, it comes like that, but you have to go to the computer now. Then you click this. You enter the password. A like. Eight, 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 four times, right there. Wait, wait just a second. Then I minimize it. I then I go to like control panel. No, this is control panel. Then you go right here. You find. Windows fire, fire firewall. Then you go right here, expectations. Then you, then you add for it. You put. And then you put that. Put that in. Yet it has to be checked like that. Then you click OK, but I'm not gonna do because I don't have it. Then check it already. Like it's gonna be that right there. Check it and then exit out. Then you're gonna go back to your DS. You're gonna wait. And then to find out if you have it and just find your internet iPort thingy yeah, just find command prompt no that CMD and put I P config it gave me my description. I enter it It's gonna appear this. And then you go to your DS. And you connect manually. And then you change the things. Like this. You Connection. That's DS. All that stuff. I can't show it to you. But I go back. I connect the Wi-Fi. It's searching, acquiring.
then you enter all that all that numbers in whichever goes on onto the DS and then you like wait I'm gonna make a change. If it doesn't show it up right, then edit it, then like put like the, um, the IP address in correctly and then put it it's gonna show you to put a password put eight 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 Voice, then I click start on my D so start button and it says virtual desktop and it's command pop command prop right now see I can control for my DS wait you do not choose right there. see it moves see right there it works and that's how you do it Goodbye. La 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 la. Yeah.